Hello friends, so in this video I'm going to tell you about how to create your Google Scholar account. So go to Google search engine and then search for Google Scholar. Yeah, once you get this, go to Google Scholar. Okay, here we go. can see here on right hand top you can see sign in okay using your Google account you need to sign in okay once you do this you will land in this page where you can see my profile right on left hand top of the screen if you click on my profile you will see this page where you can create your profile so there is a name here already you can write your affiliation right and then you write you click on next once you do this it will populate your publications right you can see here two publications published by uh, this author for whom I am creating this Google scholar account if you if you realize that these publications are yours because sometimes so happens that it will populate the publications with uh, uh, the similar name as yours so you should be careful in choosing the the populated list of publications so here I have uh, two publications I'll check here once you select these publications then click on next right so once you click on uh, next you'll be uh, taken to this page where you can see <coughs> it will ask for uh, the confirmation scholar automatically finds your new articles and changes to existing articles <coughs> as soon as you publish a new article automatically uh, your new publication will be populated and it will be featured under your profile all right so once you do this you click on that all right here we go your google scholar account is ready with the list of publications right you can see here the author for whom i have created uh, this account you can see three publications okay and you can see a citation okay in the first column you can see the number of citations the number against each paper indicates citations right and uh, in this page you will also get your h index right so what you need to do is uh, as soon as you realize that some of your publications are lost not listed here because uh, sometimes uh, the the uh, your name is abbreviated and it doesn't match with your the the name given in the email id right so in such a, a situation what you could do is you can search for that article and then list it here right <clears throat> so it's very simple and uh, this is uh, quite useful in terms of uh, getting your citations uh, for each paper and also the h index at uh, any point of time right you can add your photo here okay and you can directly download your articles directly from uh, the google scholar right
okay if you want to see who has actually uh, cited your paper if you click on the citation cited by it will take you to the paper in which uh, your article is um, cited okay <coughs> yep this uh, very easy to create provided you uh, have email id on uh, the google so using your gmail id you just have to log onto the google scholar and uh, create your profile right thank you very much for watching this video